drop. Um, Listen here, this is basic, arithmetic Divide and conquer, so charismatic Hey buddy, in the chasing hits like ethics I'd rather put lead in your ethic Bad sticks, articulate MCs are rare What's going on y'all, it's your boy Mike D Back with a video um, And today we're going to do something car related Nope, I didn't get the Travis Scott ones But we are going to do a Diamond grill Kind of mod on a CLA 250 Benz. Um, you'll see it. We'll do some before and afters and also some video along the way. But this should be a good one. All right. See y'all a little bit. Okay, so this is the kit that we have. It has all these stickers with the diagram that tells you where to put everything at. And we're going to put all these onto these corresponding spots. And when it's done, the honeycomb. on the honeycomb. And when it's done, it's going to transform this grill completely. Alright, so the first step is to wash it or clean off all that. And we got some glass cleaner, paper towels, and we'll do that right now. What kind of glass cleaner are you using? This is some spray away. Good stuff. Mm -hmm. Let's spray this, get this nice and clean. We just want to get all the dirt off of this so everything sticks really good. That way it'll last a lot longer. Okay, so we've now opened up the actual sticker kit, and it's de it's, they're actually called Diamond Grill Decals. So we've opened up the Diamond Grill Decal Kit, and this is what the instructions look like. It gives you an, an identical view of the actual decals you'll be watching in one second, and it even tells you which ones to use and which ones not to use, because these are going to be your replacement ones. So here's the actual decals here. It's held in the exact way it tells you on the instructions. Rows two and three are ones that you are not going to use. Those are the um, ones for replacement. And then from the bottom, two and three up are the ones we're not going to use. So I'll begin by letting him, Mike D, <laughs> start on the top row. Here they are. So All right, it's recording. All right, we almost got two rows done. So the wife found a trick to do these for the ones that are smaller on the inner area. If you have big fingers like me, hands, tweezer. tweezers. And it's really worked out well. So we're just gonna do some more. <laughs>
how much do we have left? Literally just right here. Like that's it. That's those couple two rows. Yep. And the rest like is pretty much done. Yep. That's about it. And then you have all those left over in case you ever need some more. Yes. They say not to wash your car for two to three weeks, but mm. a lot of people who did it already, they said they didn't have to wait that long. Let's wait. see. I mean, for us, it's about to rain anyway, so I'm not going to be washing this car anytime soon because of the rain. Okay. But um, people reported that they did not have a lot of losses. From we the saw that one video of the guy came out after doing it. Yeah. He, yeah, he did it and then went right through the car wash. He said his was fine. Yep, so these we had to order from what Germany? Yeah, these came Germany. How much were they? I definitely under fifty dollars with shipping and handling, and it took less than two weeks to get here on eBay. And us doing it together with me doing the majority of the work took how long? What? <laughs> you doing the majority of the work? Notice how I'm doing your side because my side's been done and I was bored. Whatever. <laughs> I want to say we've been out here for less than an hour and a half. I'd say a little. Less than an hour. You think it was less than an hour? Yeah. Okay. I think we did it pretty, pretty quick. You think I did it pretty quick? I think we did it. Mm. We. <laughs> the teamwork. <laughs> teamwork makes the dream work. I'm t yo, I'm, I really do recommend tweezers. I'm not kidding. I see how you're doing it. Yep. With the tweezers, you can kind of place it where you want and then yep. just push it down. Yep. I feel like the tweezers really, really do help to go fast. Let's see. I'm putting it on like that. Yep. Like that. And then just... And then literally setting it and then pushing it. That. Now, see, look, because you recorded that one. It's not that perfect. <laughs> it looks good. But I grab the corner of the tweezers, place it, and then push. See that? There you go. Yeah. Do it so good. Yeah, because you want me to finish it. <laughs> it's a little, it's a little tricky over here. Alright, so we'll finish this up. We'll be right back. Alright, like three quarters done. She's way ahead of me. Cause I'm a beast. I'm a dog. I'm a beast. All right, y'all. So we have the final product. Check that out. I mean, come on. For 50 bucks and an hour's worth of time sitting outside doing this, that is amazing. Amazing. Because it does a facelift to the actual car. You know? Yeah, the whole front of the car looks just completely different. Yeah, that looks that was well worth it. Alright y'all, so that was our video on putting those stickers on the grill. Um, if you guys haven't subscribed before, please subscribe to the channel. Drop some comments down below. Let us you know, let us know what you think of that. 75% um, of that was done by my wife. She did an amazing job doing it. So all credit should go to her. Um, she doesn't want to be on camera, but just know that she absolutely rocked that project. And again... If you guys want to leave some comments, let's talk about it. Peace.